YouTube, I'm Julie and I decided that I was gonna make a beauty vlog. So here I am. I decided that I wanted to make a vlog because I love watching um, Juicy Star 07 and All That Glitters 21 and just a couple other different beauty vlogs. Those are my favorites but I, I've been watching them a lot lately and just decided you know what I really like beauty, I really like fashion um, why not share everything with the world? So this is my vlog. I decided that I was going to do a favorites for fall. And I know that usually people do like the um, end of the month. Like, you know, right now it would probably be like I would do a uh, August favorites. Because August is over and it's now September and whatnot. But um, since I'm, I'm not really in that swing of things, I guess you could say. Um, I decided that I was going to do a upcoming fall fashion and then if you watch this video then you know and you see something in the video that you like that I have uh, you could totally just be like oh my gosh I want that you know and you can enjoy it too during the fall this way it's not like over and you know it's it's winter time and you're like oh darn I wish I had that for the fall let me get started on that I bought this hot chocolate bar of soap um, it's from the Little Egg Harbor Soap Company in Smithville, New Jersey. So, um, which is kind of cool that I'm using this now and that I pulled this out now because Smithville, it's, a, I didn't actually go to the actual Smithville store. I actually bought this at a fair in July. It was like the Red, White, and Blueberry Festival. They have a bunch of different tables set up uh, for like soaps and crafts and things like that that you can buy. And I bought three different kinds of soaps and I'm really excited to use this hot chocolate soap because smells really really good and it's totally like winter fall type of type of thing so I'm really excited to start using that but I have to use up the soap that I already have so this soap I will start using it soon the next thing I have is this it's beauty rush uh, snow plum body drink lotion it's from Victoria's Secret I'm sure you guys have seen it before it's pretty popular you know like the the brand is pretty popular or whatever um, and I've actually had this for a really long time, and I also have the spray. I got it as, like, a gift one year for Christmas, and, um, and I pulled it out yesterday, and, um, because I wanted lotion, but I was kind of like, oh, I don't want to use the lotion that I normally use. I was just kind of getting sick of it, and I pulled this out and put it on my hands, and oh my gosh, I was like, where, why, I don't know, why didn't I use, why haven't I been using this, it smells so good. Okay, the next thing I have is um, Lush product, which I got last year, and I didn't use the whole thing, and I absolutely love using this. The best thing I can tell you to use this for, it's, first of all, it smells really good. Secondly, it's, um, actually, it's the flavor, it's like, it's the white chocolate, um, this is what it looks like, it's white chocolate, it's not soap. It's a lotion bar. So this is like lotion in the form of a bar, which is pretty awesome. And um, basically, like, when you rub it against your skin, the heat from your skin, like, sort of melts it a little bit into lotion. And what it does is, um, works as a lotion. Duh. But it smells really good. And the, the thing that I love using it for is I'll put it on my legs the night before that I shower, okay? And if you get really bad razor burn put this, rub it all over your legs, right, and then the next morning shave and you'll have the softest, smoothest legs in your entire life. I guarantee it. It's amazing. So try that. I actually really want to go back to Lush. Um, there's one, it's in the city, which is kind of like 20 minutes away from where I live. So I'm not there all the time. Um, you know, it's, it's kind of like one of those places that you go like every once in a while. Same with Smithville. Like this thing is from Smithville. It's one of those places they kind of visit like once or twice a year. I probably go to the city more than once or twice a year, but whatever. Liplicious Almond Cocoa. This stuff, it tastes really good. I've had a few people like smell it and they're like, no, that doesn't smell very good. I guess if you don't like almonds, it doesn't smell very good. But if you like almonds and chocolate and stuff like that it smells incredible I love it it tastes really good and it's not it's sheer like it says sheer on it but it's not one of those um it's not like super sheer like it's not completely see-through it does give you a little bit of color I actually have it on right now um it gives you just like a slight bit of color on your lips which is pretty cool 
this is my next item. It's um, a bracelet, and it's in the shape of a bow, obviously. I bought it at Seven for All Mankind, which is an amazing store. I had never been in there before. I went in July. I had, like, found my first ever Seven for All Mankind. I loved it. It was amazing, but um, some of their stuff is kind of expensive, and I'm really weird about spending a lot of money. So it's really cute. I love it, and I'm so excited to wear it for fall. It's just, I don't know, it's brown, it's leather. It just seems kind of fallish to me. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I'm not sure. But um, the next thing I have is another accessory. It's actually a scarf, and oh my gosh, I love this scarf. It's really big, it's really soft, and it's really comfortable. I just bought it a um, couple weeks ago. It's still too warm here. Uh, to actually like, yeah, that's what it looks like. It's still too warm to actually wear it, but I just cannot wait until it starts to get, sorry, just fixing myself there. I can't wait for it to start getting warmer because it's really soft. Like you wouldn't believe how soft this is. It's so soft, so comfortable, and um, I'm really excited to wear it with this coat that I bought. Um, I bought this coat at Columbia the Columbia store. It's a trench coat. It's really, really, really pretty. I don't know if you can see the whole thing, but it's really heavy. I actually had a trench coat uh, last year. I bought a trench coat from, I believe it was Forever 21 I bought it from, and it's like a lighter coat. It's a lighter trench coat. This one's much heavier. This one's definitely more of a wintertime trench coat, but I'm so excited because it's really nice. It was made by Columbia, which is a great brand, and um, it's so warm, and I can't wait to wear the coat with the scarf. Let me know what your favorite fall items are. You know, leave it in the comments below. Tell me what you're excited about for fall, even for winter, you know. And, um, I don't know. I guess that's it. I've never made one of these videos before, so I'm just kind of like, I don't know. Um, but just, uh, I guess leave a video response to all of this. I tag everybody who wants to join uh, in on this excited about fall kind of video. And I will talk to you guys, I guess, a little bit later. Oh, and I wanted to tell you, I'm really excited. The color on my nails, which actually matches my wall back here. Whoa, that's kind of freaky. Um, it's the OPI. Um, Stranger Tides color and I'm a huge Pirates of the Caribbean fan so when I saw that they were selling like all these different colors I had to buy them. Um, so I got this one and then I also got one that's pink and I can't remember what it's called but um, if I wear it I'll let you know so yeah. On Stranger Tides color it's green. I, I don't know. I'm in love with it. I'm head over heels. Like when this chips off I'm probably gonna repaint them this color. Well maybe not but I'll, I'll You'll see that I'll have it on again in another video. Alright, I promise you this is the last time I'm leaving. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!